Go ahead, Jim. David, terrific win by your club today. Uh, everyone will concentrate on the bases clearing situation. What did you see from your perspective that caused it? And what was the explanation from the umpire given to you of why Castellanos was singled out as the only one ejected? Yeah, I mean, what I saw was a really aggressive, you know, big base running play by, by Nick at, at uh, you know, the start of the play where ball got, a, got away and he had a great read and made a really aggressive and great slide to, to get in just barely to, to score really a big run in the game. Um, you know, I know he, he got up, he was excited. Um, I saw him celebrate a little bit and then I saw him walk off, walk away. And uh, next thing I knew, you know, I saw a lot of, uh, you know, people running on the field. Um, you know, I'm looking over towards the Cardinals bench and I saw some of the coaches run out. So then it was just kind of everyone um, came out there to protect uh, their team. So um, that's what I saw um, on that particular play. Were you given an explanation of why he was ejected? I think just kind of what I just said. It was, he got up and, and so, you know, celebrated, I guess. I don't, you know, um, I, I didn't. I, I, that, that's what I saw. I think that was the explanation. Offense, uh, you had your struggles last year, at least in the first two games. How pleased are you with your offense so far? Um, definitely. You know, a lot of uh, a lot of big hits, a lot of big at bats to keep innings going. Um, you know, and just creates more opportunities for for us to score runs and uh, you know extending the innings, getting more guys to the plate. And guys are, are doing a good job of. Um, you know, putting tough pitches in play and hitting the ball hard. Um, you know, a lot of a lot of big hits today. A lot of big, a lot of them were singles. Um, um, you know, of course, Barney's home run was a, a real big hit in the game, but um, just a lot of good things happening with our offense. Lost in the shuffle. How pleased were you with Tyler Malley today? Yeah, I thought he had a great fastball. Um, I know he. Of the, the home runs, at least one of the, the pitches to DeYoung was a slider. Um, I'm not sure about the second one, but uh, I, I thought he had as good a fastball as, you know, uh, similar to what we saw most of last season. And, um, you know, when he has this fastball going, that's it's a big strength of his. Thank you, David. Okay. Thank you, Jim. David, you guys have uh, 15 runs in two days, and double-digit hits on both games. How, how much does that say about your offense uh, right out of the gate? Um, yeah, I mean, our offense is, um, you know, worked hard, you know, just like we did last year. And it, it's, it's nice to see, even though we're, you know, two games into the season, it, it's important to see some results, um, success. I think, you know, a lot of confidence can come from, from uh, having success, so uh, it, it's nice to see. I mean, guys deserve it, earn earn it. Um, you know, worked hard all last year, and and uh, you know, I think we, you know, we learned a lot about ourselves offensively. Um, you know, and and we knew that uh, coming into the season, you know, it was going to be a, a different year. You know, and I think we worked hard. All winter and all spring, you know, made any necessary adjustments, and um, you know now we have to do it in in the games during the season, and it's been a good start for for two for two games, and really from spring training, you know, and kind of carried carried into uh, the first couple of games here. David, you know, uh, Nick seems to Castellano seems to kind of carry himself with with that edge. Um, how much do you guys enjoy that, and and what do you see from him? And, and can you guys kind of I don't know build off that and and take that as almost an identity for this team? Yeah, I mean Nick Castellanos has been you know really an outstanding player in this league for a long time. Um, I think it's really important uh, to play with an edge for sure uh, for for any player, and I, and I think Nick does that, and I think that's part of why he's so good. Um, I think it can come out in a lot of different ways, depending on your personality, depending on a lot of different things. And, you know, we encourage guys to, 
um, to play hard. We encourage guys to be, you know, themselves um, because we have good people here and we have people that have um, worked hard to get to this point. And, uh, you know, respect is really important to us. But, but also, you know, you have to have an edge to and some toughness to play in this league. And he, 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 has, he has all that. And um, we're, you know, we, we love how he plays the game. It seemed like another big day for Jonathan India too, and, and especially a great defensive play and then a, a pair of hits. Yeah, I mean that. You're right. That was a big play. Um, really, a. I mean, really a great play. Um, I thought I didn't think he had a chance, you know, and nothing against him, but just where the ball was hit and um, to to make the the play like he did in that way just shows athleticism and and it really shows a, you know, a nose for the ball and just wanting to get to the ball and wanting to finish the play. And, um, you know, another guy that plays with an edge, plays with some, you know, real confidence and um, just loves to play. He's he's loving being here and being part of this team. David, when you brought Nick Senzel into the game and Winker came out, did Winker tweak anything? No, he was he, he was just feeling it wasn't feeling great, um, so I think everything's going to be fine. But he um, just wasn't wasn't feeling well, so we got him out of there. You know, one more for David. You, you talked about the offense a few times, but just an inning like he did in the third inning, where you know last year it seemed so much like home runs kind of dictated the offense. To have, like you mentioned, singles, kind of and a lot of infield singles at, at that. Is that kind of a sign of the offense evolutionizing a little bit or kind of buying into yeah. the line drive approach? I think so. Um, you know, we want, you know, we want our guys to be who they are. We want to maximize who they are. I think, uh, you know, still try to keep it simple, hitting the ball hard. And, you know, the pitching that, that we face is tough. So, you know, you can't try to do too much and you're just trying to hit the ball hard. But, um, we don't want to try to do too much either. And if our team was guilty of anything last year, and I'm, you know, I totally get it and understand why. Like sometimes maybe we tried to do a little too much, um, just because we wanted it to to win so bad, you know. And you can live with that. And I think just kind of staying with the simplicity of just trying to hit the ball hard, and um, you know, singles are are good too. And uh, you know, I think tonight tonight we saw, you know, that keeping the innings alive and creating more, you know, creating more opportunities, more runners, and sending more hitters to the plate. Thank you, guys. 11 a.m. tomorrow. Thank you all. Thank you.